time at 2 a.m. in the morning, precisely. was a magnificent performance on the whole though the princess was thoroughly oh. grateful Ole! <laughs> oh froggy dear froggy you good kind wonderful creature oh dear i've been so bad to you please forgive me shall i shall i give you a kiss Needed that. Oh my god, you're you're a man. Well, actually I'm more than a man, I'm a prince. I'm Hal's elder brother. Good grief. Well, thanks a lot. Ta, I better be going no, now. Don't don't move. Why? Well, you're you're naked. <laughs> so I am. <laughs> Sorry about that. Oh, it's all right. <laughs> well, I guess I didn't think of that. Who's they? Uh oh. The people who work the spells. You mean this was a spell? Oh, yes. I, I have this eccentric fairy godmother, and, well, Mum and Pops forgot to invite her to the christening, and wham, bam, thank you, ma'am, she turned me into a frog. How oh, awful. Well, yes. And I can only be turned back into a prince by a kiss from a true princess. And that must be you, you are heaven sent. Thank you. Well, how amazing. Yes, oh, isn't that something? Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, oh, we have to get you out of here. If they find you in here, they'll kill you. Well, can't we just tell them the truth? Well, who would believe it? Yes, yes, I guess you're right. Mm hmm. Mm. No. I've been thinking. Yes? Yeah. I'm a little worried right now. Maybe, maybe you could, uh, just kiss me again to make sure that I don't turn back into a frog. Oh, you mean just for scientific purposes? Yes. I mean, just to make sure that the, the spell is broken. Oh, absolutely. Because, you see, I am a true princess and I can turn you back. I know that, but... And if you don't turn back, then we'll know that you're all right. Oh, yes, yes. Well, all right. All right. Mm. Mm. <laughs> Any change? Oh, not yet. Maybe we should give it a bit longer. Mm. <laughs> mm. <laughs> Who is that? Who is it? Your father, open up! Oh. What was all that noise? What noise? Where's the frog? What frog? Oh, the frog! He left. How? Out the window. Whoa! Over oh, here! Oh, Over here! Oh, oh. Did, did you throw him out? Why, no. You cruel, heartless little princess. Oh, that's not true. I'm going to teach you a lesson you won't forget. Guards, turn your backs. No. I'm going to thrash some respect into you, you vain, selfish, spoiled, frog-murdering little princess. No! no. Uh, uh, who said that? I did. Well, you're not going to believe... Oh, no, 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 not as bad as it looks. You're never going to believe this, Father. Who is that? 
he is the frog. Yeah, pull the other one. How long has this been going on? But you don't understand. What's your name? Uh, uh, prince Robin. Uh -huh. Yeah, Prince Robin. Indeed. There is no such prince. Do you know what the penalty is for being caught in a princess's bed? Oh, no, 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 please. I, I, I know this doesn't look very good. Oh, no, no, no. I, 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 I didn't do anything. Guards, throw him into the deepest dungeon you can find. No, no, please, no, no, please. No, 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 you can't. I'm naked. <gasps> you! <gasps> no, no! <clears throat> Remove him! Oh, no, oh, no, please! Wait, oh. No. Oh. Oh. Goodbye, Froggy! Oh. 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 So the prince was thrown into the deepest dungeon, far from the light of day, and fed only bread and water. And the princess was sent off to a very strict boarding school, where she was forced to learn Latin and play hockey. And the king fell into a great decline, and the kingdom withered, and the queen became ill, and all might have ended disastrously were it not for the prince's fairy godmother, who, realizing at last the folly of the misery she'd caused, appeared to the king in the golden ball. And she told him the entire story of the frog prince, just as I've told it to you. And the king cried for joy and apologized to the prince and sent for the princess from the very strict boarding school and all was forgiven and forgotten, although he did insist that on moral grounds they should marry at once. happily ever after, and the prince's fairy godmother promised that that would be the very last of her frog tricks.